everyone? How's it going? I hope you like my new hairdo because I want to welcome you to the Hair Dye Rodeo! First we have up the unicorn hair from Lime Crime Bubblegum Rose all the way from March 2021. Next up we have the brand new right off the shelf February 2023 Aero Aero Neon Green. Next up in line from back in May of 2022 where it wasn't on my hair but someone else's we have Arctic Fox's Poseidon. Going back a few more days from May 2022, we got April 2022, Lunar Tides Neon Lemon Color. And last but not least, the Dynamic Duo, all the way from July 2021, that turned my hair purple, which I did not want whatsoever. We have Arctic Fox's Wrap and Arctic Fox's Transylvania. Now, in case if you haven't um, figured it out, I am going to dye my hair colors. I have had so many colors that I have not finished up. There are some here that I've had that I threw away because they were so old. These ones are more recent and I'm really hoping that I will be using up at least some of them. So this is why my hair is a little crazy, kind of like the doll from Rugrats. Um, I apologize in advance if you do hear some snow blowing outside. We got hit again with some snow, but I'm not surprised because weather happens. So I have an idea of what I want to do. Underneath here, all the way around, I want all that to be like a dark purple, some kind of dark Base. That's why I <laughs> want one, two of these because uh, they uh, turned my hair purple that one time. I did not record that video. It was really bad. Actually, here's what it turned out to be when I rinsed out the color. I think I rinsed a little too long and I got this purple. So that's a little on my part, but also who, what, how would I was supposed to know it was going to be purple? And then the sides here, I'm not really sure because on the top, I'm going to use all of these colors. I still don't know if I'm going to just do like chunks of the same color or if I should split it and then one color, one color, one color, one color, one color. Because I have found a really good hairstyle for me now that my hair is growing a little longer. When I flip the hair to this side, I braid it and it actually stays put. If I do that, you know, it'll be all different colors. These parts right here and in the back I have sectioned off. They're not gonna like coincide. They're not gonna match with what's up here. They're gonna be like alternate different colors. In the lineup that I just showed you, um, that's the lineup that's gonna be on the top part. I really don't know how it's gonna turn out. I know I'm gonna cross-contaminate some colors, especially with the yellow. All right, so this is one video where it's not gonna be very quick. It's gonna be very tedious. It's gonna be a little longer than usual. So please bear with me. <laughs> I really appreciate it. This is more elaborate than the tricolored hair video and I've never done anything like this before in my life and I've decided I am going to use my fingers my hands to distribute the color as opposed to having a brush I mean maybe for the purple I'll use a brush for these parts up here they're just so they're gonna be so thin that there's no point these top layers put them back to the ponytail because I know like they're gonna get in the way here is my regular bowl gonna Oh, <laughs> gotta be careful. Make it go crazy. So I don't know if you can see that's that. Arctic Fox's hair dye smells really good. Oh no. Uh, the, <laughs> ah! the thing clogged. Just open it. Plop it in for you. That's a lot of it. You know what? Maybe I should also mix in some of the blue. Let me just mix the Wrath and the Transylvania together. It's actually making it really, 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 really dark. All right, now it looks more like a maroon or a plum. I'm gonna have to need a lot of dye for the bottom. I think I added too much Transylvania. You know what? I'm just gonna go crazy and add some- oh wait. And last and last 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 not but not least, for an encore we have the Aero Aero Silver! Da, 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 da. So just for fun, I'm going to put some of this in here because why not? Just as a reminder, this is what it looks like. Yeah, alright, so let's just use it. <laughs> oh man, it looks more of a red than a purple. I'm gonna leave it as is. But I'll tell you this much, I will definitely have enough of this color, and you know what, I'll, I might have some left over. We're just gonna leave it like that. And I have a towel with me, so I'll be able to wipe my hands between colors. So for right now, sit back and relax and try to enjoy this part. I'm going to have extra fun doing it. If you want to see the first swatch here, Oh, yeah.
that's that. Moving on. Like I said, I have a ton left, so if I want, if I like this color, I'll just use this another time. I'm gonna put this over here so I don't knock it over everywhere. I would not be a happy camper. All right, now here's the tedious, like the really, really, really tedious part. I have hair dye going down my neck. So I guess logical thing to do is do the these guys next. Let me think about this for a second. Give me a second. All right, maybe two seconds. Thank you. All right, what I really want to do is maybe just do two or three colors on these little sides. And I really want to do the pink and the yellow just because I really like pink and yellow, apparently. That's like the least that I have. And I do want the top to be pretty vibrant. So <clears throat> I don't think it would work out, but what I could do is do like wrath and another color. So it like kind of works its way up through the color spectrum, <laughs> I guess. You know what I don't have? I don't have orange because I've never, except for the tricolor, Color. That's a guava color, but I'm talking like orange, like neon orange, like the dark sun neon orange. I don't have that, and I don't think I ever did, which is probably something that I will do in the future. But I don't have that, so I don't have all the basic colors of Roy G. Biv. But you know, I could make it, but the thing is, I don't have enough dye for it. You know what I should have done? I should have kept the Iro Iro silver and just did that on the sides. That would have been kind of cool. That'd be cool. Wait, do I have any other colors? Is this person trying to tell me something? <laughs> They're probably like, hurry up! You know what, I'm just gonna do green and green and green. <laughs> oh, that'd be Christmas colors, I don't want that. I've decided I'm going to do black. So I didn't really have to worry about the sides getting like the that color. Oh, <gasps> you know what it could do? <laughs> I'll alternate the Transylvania and the Wrath. Done, deal. Here we go. So now for the really fun, fun, fun part. <laughs> now here I gotta be really careful because the hairs in the back that, I ha that I'm holding on to, they're very short. I was gonna say if I miss those, then I'd get really upset. But at the same time, it is like a yellowy-ish color. So that's kind of even. I don't really care how even it is. Now here's where the pattern comes in. So I'm gonna start with my bubblegum pink. For this side, I might go backwards of the, the lineup. Okay, let's see how this is gonna come out. Okay, good. Phew. I forgot how good this smells. It smells like a coconut vanilla conditioner, but I forgot I'm not doing that first. Sorry, I am so out of it. So we're not doing that first. We're doing this first. We're doing yellow first. Like I said two seconds ago, by the way, one of my favorite colors <laughs> for hair dye. It's not going to be as neon as it was for the tricolored, but hey, it is very, still very, very yellow. We'll do sections like this. You wanna know something funny? I have about the same exact amount of hair dye that I started with, given the fact that I even have more than what I have started with. This is not good. All right, when you look at my hair colors, don't they remind you of like 90s toys? Like this is the, these are the color schemes of the 90s toys. Like if you ever played with those, parachute things in elementary school 
or I don't know blocks this is what it looks like I actually was not expecting these colors to look like this I keep going back to play-doh too this is kind of reminding me of play-doh once again but uh yeah so this is not what I was expecting at all I probably should have done thinner strips overall i'm not going for like a holographic kind of look obviously i'm a little nervous of what this is actually going to look like the colors themselves are gorgeous as you can tell they are just so beautiful i don't know how it's going to look but it's okay because march is saint patrick's day that doesn't make any sense march is saint patrick's day march is the month where saint patrick's day takes place so there's you know some rainbow stuff going on i'm gonna leave these on for another 45 minutes at least so it's gonna be a while but fingers crossed and pray that it's gonna look we'll see all right guys we're gonna take a brief intermission we'll see you back for act two all right y'all not sure if you're ready for this ready okay it came out so well let's uh just bask in it real quick just take a little looky loo side to side <laughs> And if you want to take a closer look. Isn't that so cool? Here, for some reason, you can't see how purple this is. So maybe in the back you might be able to. The light doesn't do any justice because it's such a dark burgundy color. But it looks, I don't know, for some reason it looks really dark on camera. I was going to come here and show it to you braided. But I braided it and it actually looks really weird. <laughs> My roots are growing in and when I braided it back like this, it's just mostly like dark and then just these little tiny strings of color. So um, I decided just to show you it down because it shows the most color, of course. But yes, that's just not, that's not to say that I won't braid it. I'm glad at how it turned out. I really am. No complaints other than how my hair is growing out. It's, it's a little weird. Again, it still reminds me of Play-Doh, just like the tricolored video. <laughs> it just reminds me of playfulness of childhood of youth just happy feelings i guess it's, it gives off a good vibe to me it just it just gives off a very happy light-hearted vibe and um, i'm really digging it the one thing i will say though the hardest part of this whole process was actually rinsing the color out so what i did is i started out with like the color parts first and i held back the purple base i went to the sink i tried to put it underneath the faucet and just rinsed out the individual colors at first and then once I got most of the color out I twisted out the water and then I put it up on my head so then I went to the bathtub put my head down like I usually do and tried my best to rinse out the excess purple and the purple was crazy like you saw that I had a ton of product in my hair and a ton of product came out a lot of the color came out <laughs> But of course, see here, it's as vibrant and dark as ever. But a lot kept coming out and out and out. I know now, compared to the last time I did this, the Transylvania and the Wrath, there is a time to stop even if the color is co is still coming out. Yes, I will be keeping this for the rest of March and hopefully into April, to be honest with you, because this is, I'm really digging this color. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. If you like what you see here, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. You haven't seen my tricolored hair video, Video, you can check it out if you watch that and compare it to this video this one is definitely more intricate also check out our other hair videos that we've done here not just me but also Nick has some um, hair videos as well so thank you again so much for watching everybody and I hope you have a great rest of your day <laughs> bye